All right, so I have this new battery tester from Top Don. They sent it to me for free to test, so thank you guys. I'm gonna see if it is any good. I've always wanted one of these where you plug it into your battery and it tells you whether your battery is alive or dead. And not just a voltage test, but actually a, a charging test and a cranking test. So like you would get at the mechanic. Um, there's your UPC code if you wanna buy it. And it is the Top Don Arty Battery 101. Now let's see how it works and let's see if my batteries are any good. So you hook it up to your battery and it's gonna ask you some questions, an English language, in the vehicle, before charge, regular flooded. So here you can pick different types of battery. Like I'll, we'll do an AGM at the end of this video. Uh, cold cranking amps, there's also different ways to test it. I just run with the cold cranking amps because you can see on the top of the battery what the amperage is. So here I set it to 640, which matches what it says on the battery. And then I'm gonna hit okay. And it's going in the battery and trying to figure out if it's good or bad. So let's see what we get. So state of health is 38%, that's that one. And then state of charge is 98%. There's 425 cranking amps and it gives you the resistance as well. And it thinks that I should replace it. I probably wanna clean my battery terminals first and just make sure that that's not an issue with this particular battery. And so now we can do some running tests with the battery as well. So now it rolls right into the next test, tells me to start the engine to do the cranking test. So we fire it up. It detects the RPMs and it says that it is dot, 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 cranking normal. So that's good. It's cranking at normal speed. That makes me happy. So this battery has more amps than my car needs. So maybe at even partial percent, it's okay. So now it wants a loaded test with the engine running. Now it wants me to rev it up. So we rev it up. This is to test my charging system to make sure I've getting enough voltage to the battery. And it's telling me I'm around 14 and a half loaded and unloaded. So that's good. That means its charging system is good. Now on to my motorcycle. Not just any motorcycle, but my motorcycle that won't start. My American motorcycle. We plug it in here. And this is an AGM battery, absorbed glass mat, I believe that stands for. A different type of battery. They told me it was better and they charged me more money for it, but it still doesn't work, bastards. And AGM flat plate. So let's see how it tests. 310 cold cranking amps. So you want to adjust the amps for whatever battery you're testing. This one's a little battery, so it's got half the power of the big ones in my car and my truck. Replace. So it's 56% health, even though it's all the way charged up, and it doesn't want to crank the old big 1200cc bastard over. All right, let's check the battery in the old heavy Chevy here. 660. Testing. Replace. Oh, no. Sorry, kid. No college for you. We're going to be spending all your college money on batteries.